man, it's me, Kevin Smith. Welcome to Sundance 2017 right here at the IMDb studio. And we're going to talk to the maker and the cast of Marjorie Prime. Give it up for him, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> the great Michael Amoreta. Sir, tell us about Marjorie Prime. This is based on a play, correct? It's a play. Lois Smith led me to this play. She was so excited about it. The least I could do was watch her in it. And we had martinis afterwards, as I remember. And I, I said I could see it as a movie and wondered if that would be interesting to her to pursue. We were lucky that the writer agreed it would be a good idea. And here we are two years later, so it's kind of magical. But in the, in the play, Marjorie, Lois, is married to Walter, mm. played by John Hamm, widowed. John That's plays an embodiment, a holographic mm. embodiment of her former husband. So John and Lois are the parents of Tess, played by Gina Davis. And Tess is married to John, played by Tim Robbins. Ma'am, you are a national treasure. Well, Absolutely. Thank you. Give it up for Lois, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. I have been a longtime fan. I, this must be thrilling for you to play the role on the stage and then take it to film. What's Absolutely. the big difference between proscenium style and taking it to cinema on a stage or something? Oh, boy, are you right. It is, you don't get to do this very often. It's really exciting. The play is so much more verbal because that often is how plays are, and I love that. It's a play about memory, about living, about what our memories are. John Hamm playing Walter Prime, who is a hologram, is receiving um, his information through other people's telling him about it, and he's helping with Marjorie's memories by keeping her in touch with the life they lived. Now, you play her husband. You finally are paired up with someone on screen as absolutely gorgeous as you are in this instance, ma'am. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it was pitched to me. It was like, well, uh, Lois is your wife, and Tim Robbins and Gina Davis are your kids. And I was like, yeah. <laughs> I'm in. Where did we start shooting? And I was like, OK, you got me. <laughs> Mr. Robbins? What about this flick right here? This is a beautiful, beautiful project. This, um, I, I love the. The, the the poetry in it it's it, it's it's a it's a, it's like a, a a meditation in a lot of ways about uh, life and memory and uh, love and uh, how fleeting all of those can be and uh, it was it came to me really quickly I, I think I was I read the script and was shooting within two weeks or something like that yeah and uh, it, it was that strong. I, I usually take a lot of time to make a decision, mm -hmm. and reading this script, I, I, I jumped right in. Ms. Davis, how was it acting with these fine folks? Oh, fantastic. I, I love all these guys. I, I had such a great time, and Michael, and I was the same way. I read the script, and I was like, I'm in. That, it, it was, it's so uh, moving, and, uh, and I was going to use that word you just did, meditation. It's kind of like a meditation on what it is to be a human and you know, uh, and and how much of us, of who we think we are, is based on our memories and, and all that. I, th I think it's fascinating. I'm so proud of how it came out. Mm -hmm.